Hi. Um. What's up guys, Carly here, and welcome back to another Cat Chats video! You know, I told myself that I'd be really motivated to do these on a regular basis, but, um, <laughs> anyways, today we are back with more Rainbow High and a little Monster High, so without further ado, let's begin. We're going to start with Rainbow High, and it looks like the entire thing is getting a reboot. Now, I don't really know why they've decided to do this, but they're doing it, so... <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> it looks like the first wave of this reboot is going to include Ruby, Sunny, Skylar, Jade, Violet, and Amaya. <laughs> Yep, guess Poppy is not included in this reboot for the moment, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> it isn't like Poppy's my favorite Rainbow High character or whatever. <laughs> they ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't. It also seems like the show is also getting a reboot, so love that. The biggest part of this reboot, it looks like, is they seem to be returning to the slime gimmick that they already decided didn't work and got rid of. So, yeah, that's that. Um, so, my personal thoughts on this reboot is, um... No. Yeah, I'm definitely not feeling this reboot. The faces, the outfits are definitely giving Monster High G2, and that was just not a great time. So, uh... I really hope MGA realizes that doing this means they're going to be losing a lot of the adult collector crowd, which includes me! Which is unfortunate, because I really did love these dolls. Like, I was so happy when these were, when the first wave came out, and I was just like, yes, finally, these dolls are popping, and now we're here. Um, two, three years later, so that's unfortunate. Um... <laughs> Now that we've gotten that out of the way, let's get into Monster High. So it seems the original six dolls are getting a core refresh. Now we've all seen Claudine and Draculaura. They're serving. They're serving looks. Um, they're definitely glow ups. Uh, Claudine definitely is, but. <laughs> and Draculaura. I love her as well, but I also loved her original doll a lot, so yeah. But uh, we're not here to talk about that. We're here to talk about. Frankie, Laguna, and Cleo. Now, I really love Frankie and Cleo. For me personally, they are also huge glow-ups compared to their original G3 dolls. Especially Cleo, because... Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, Laguna, however, I'm a bit skeptical about her outfit because of the pants. I just really don't know how to feel about them yet. I really don't my drag right um but we are also getting new dolls for g3 soon we have spectra venus and caddy honestly i'm a little disappointed with spectra's outfit i don't hate it but it looks very similar to her midnight runway doll and um the price difference <laughs> mm, yeah um Venus I really like. She's definitely one of my favorite G3 redesigns so far. Like, she didn't need to serve this hard, um, but she did, and she's here, and we're all grateful. So, um, yeah. And then there's Caddy. Now, I don't hate the fact that she's curvy. I love that we're getting different body types, and it's my favorite thing about Monster High Generation 3. However... I hate her outfit, and I really need it to be changed, so. <laughs> Anyways, overall, the refresh definitely gets a thumbs up from me. I will definitely be buying, purchasing, because, um, I'm me. <laughs> Alright, that is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please make sure to click like and subscribe if you aren't already. 
Also, make sure to follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter at Hoy It's Carly. And on that note, goodbye, peoples, and has a great day. Bye.